Well, hello, folks. In just a moment, I'm going to take this out for a quick run on 2S. Before I go, just want to show you what's in the box real quick. Comes with manual, decals, tools, transmitter, and the car itself. And I also want to add, before I go out there, I always go through the checklist that I put in the beginning. Make sure all the screws and nuts are all tight. Check the fail safe. If you don't know how to do it, look at the manual. In addition, I went into the ESC to check the LVC, which is a low voltage cutoff for the light bulb batteries. It is default at 3.0, which is pretty good. It is still safe. But to be on the safer side, I push it up to 3.2. And also I went through some of the programs. The punch and the manual is at the default was at seven. However, when I went into the program itself inside the ESC, it was the default at a five. So I left it at five right now. And overall, there's a total of nine that you can get up to and see how I like it before I make any changes. All right, the snow is a little bit too much. It's kind of hard to ride today. So I got to walk over there. It's going to be a quite a hike up there find a nice little spot so I could test the speed on this RC car. Hey, to be honest guys, I actually kind of like days like these. It's not too cold because it's not windy and the sun is out. So it's really enjoyable right now. I'm having a great time. All right, guys, I'm out here. It's the weekend. So it's kind of hard for me to find a good spot to run. There's a lot of people out right now. So every time I go to the end, I gotta make sure there's no cars. There's a car coming. It's on 2S right now and it's fast. It drives really smooth so far, very stable. It almost won a wheelie, but the floor is kind of wet. Wow! I do have a GPS in there, so we'll see how fast it's gonna go. Oh, you see that? It did pop. Oh, shit. I gotta go get it before the car comes. It is a lot of power. They are right. This thing is a lot meaner and tougher. Well, I haven't tested the tough part. Definitely meaner. It's a car. So there's a lot of cars. I gotta make sure I don't run into them. I can't really test out the handling. But so far, it seems really predictable. I'm liking the feeling of it. Oh, we can't because it just dipped right in. That one works too soft. Maybe harder pack snow. That's the one thing about two wheel drive. Real wheel drive RC cars is that you can slide them so well. It's so much more fun. I think there's another car coming. Oh yep, there's another car coming, I gotta stop. Well, another car coming. Good thing we can edit, right? Every time they come by, I just edit out of it. It's in the upper 20 degrees today, so the top speed on this will not be as fast as on a warmer day, but I still want to check to see where is it at. It's fast. Wow. Guys, I'm liking this a lot, to be honest with you right now. I'm happy that I bought it. it spun out a little bit. Can't wait to take this to the skate park and test it out. Hit the water just to test it. I gotta hit these snows, see what happens. Oh yeah! Whoop, crashed! After that little hit at first, the server went out of whack, so hopefully I didn't strip any gears. Seems to work fine right now. I mean, for the price, it would be nice if they actually put a metal server in here also. On top of some aluminum shocks, right? Do one more speed run, one more pass. That's the longest one I did. And then let's come back and check the speed. I am running a 2S 5200 mAh Z battery. 36.6 on 2S stock gearing. This is outstanding guys. 
So I'm guessing on 3S it will probably hit another 10 miles per hour more, or maybe in the mid 40s, 45 maybe. So I'll be excited to see uh, how it goes. But here you have it guys, just a short run on 2S with the HPI jump shot. And if you haven't seen the unboxing video yet, make sure you go and check it out. Alright, until next time, hit the like button. Peace out, stay awesome.